Hey guys, welcome to Dazzling Handmade. My name is Fiona and I thought it was time to show my face. Um, we're doing another craft supply haul video, which I'm gonna show you all the stuff I bought. Um, in here we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven packages. And this one has some few in it. So if I open this one, there's a couple more inside of it. <sighs> Let's see what I received today. And thank you so much for everyone who has been watching my videos and commenting. I appreciate it so much. Let's get started. Okay, so this is gonna be the first little package I'm gonna start with. And in here, we have some cutting guys. Okay, instead of white paper, I found this uh, top, this box top, which I think is gonna work very well. Okay, so we have a cutting die with, I think these are tulips, and then this little round one. Ooh, look how cute this is. It's a bunny. It's, and then we have this wavy something something. And then this heart-shaped birds sitting on flowers, roses, it looks like. And then a champagne bottle with some glasses. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so that is from the first package. Alright, next one. Looks like it's one single item and it's a... Uh, it's a woman sitting on a chair with her cat drinking a cup of tea, it looks like. The feet looks a little bit odd. She's wearing slippers, but I'm not really sure what that circle is on the front. But um, yeah, the feet looks a little bit funky. Next. Oh wow, look at that. Treasure. What do we have in here? Wow, look at that. That's beautiful. I still have not figured out the name of this exact thing with the little, uh, it's a kind of like glittery, um, there's glitter powder in it, but there's also those little bits and pieces. Oh wow, look at that. This is a whole set. Um, it said it came from Newcastle. These are very pretty. And I like that they are individually packed, although they are very, very similar. And there's one more in here, and these are little circles. I don't have little circles like this, so that would be fun to use. They're very pretty colors, too. Super tiny, though. So that was a good buy. Next. Whoa. Stamps, sentiments, both are sentiments. You brighten my day, sorry you're feeling under the weather. You're in my thoughts, thank you, my friend. Be yourself, hello sunshine, congratulations, have a happy day. Thanks for all you do, I really appreciate it. I think these are very nice and um, sentiments are always good because I feel like I, I didn't have enough. And all the sentiments I did have are very similar. Okay, so let me see. This, uh, like this. So it looks like lamps, like the, the little lighting lamps for Christmas because I do see a couple of uh, snowflakes. So this is very, it's supposed to be like a Christmas theme. I will not know the quality of the cutting dies until I cut them individually for my uh, examples, which I do make uh, videos of, and that you can find in the playlist. It's a big stamp. That is huge. It's very, very large. Very large stamp. I love these because you can get very, very, create 
creative and playful with the colors you can do let's say yellow flower and then a green outline to it this outline so i think this is yeah this is amazing and i hope the quality of it is good but again we will not know until we test it out um i am a little bit worried about these ones on the bottom because they might be a little bit too crowded some other things came in this package we got some cutting die wish i think it says with you uh just for you and oh baby something and then we also have some teacups which i think could be a duplicate um then we have oh this is a cutting die for the stamp so we have this stamp so lots of great sentiments and we have a cutting die for it which is very good and then uh, then this cutting die oh is this this is for this one look at that that is perfect next package oh we got a note we had an item out of stock um so i ordered something from them and says they had something out of stock this is a Corgi! Oh, look at that butt! <laughs> Sorry, I forgot your big day. Let's party like royal tea. That's cute. Very cute corgis. Oh, these are Elizabeth's corgis with a little crown. Very cute. I have to remember that. Alright, we have a large, big package here. Something wrapped up. Ooh, looking can this be it's like christmas you buy stuff and you forget about it and then it's like whoa what are those yeah wow they were not greedy with the packaging and just, like half of this package is just packaging material look at all that <laughs> oh my where do we start okay so we got some leaves right here got some leaves uh more leaves oh i think this is a duplicate it's the same colors and then we got um snowflakes uh just random little glitter pieces this one is um little beads and they are in different sizes that's really good. I like to use these on flowers. And then we have hearts. Very nice. And then uh, just different kinds of little elements, decorations. I think these circle ones are going to be very beautiful on cards. Then we have this insanely gorgeous little stars. Gold and silver silver and they're they're actually um if you can hear it so it's not made of paper it's made of something thicker and another one of this uh circly ones it's similar but not the same as the one i was i was showing earlier so very pretty <gasps> look at these little flowers how adorable is that it's uh, made of plastic and it's flat on the bottom so you can glue it. And then we got two of these uh, packages. Very cute. It's gonna be very hard to glue this. I think I'm gonna like these little. Oh, there's. Okay. Um, uh, I think it's gonna be kind of hard. Mickey Mouse heads put them in one by one so what I think I'm gonna do is put some glue down on the paper and then just sprinkle this over it and I, and I hope it will stick to it and then we have uh, more flowers like um, plastic flowers cute very very cute that was a great package um, let's see this one Okay, let's see uh, this 
one. Oh, this is from Alina Craft. They usually put their information right there. So from, from them, I got three double-sided tape. Yeah, they're usually very fast with their shipping. And they have pretty good price. Alright, let's see what's in this big package that has more package inside. So in here we have one, two, three, four packages. I'm not really sure why they put these individual packages into big one big package, but I think when USPS receives multiple packages like this from one seller. And here we have a few packages. These are stickers, I believe. Collection record. Mushroom stickers. So just to show you kind of what they look like. Very cute. And there's, uh, I ordered six of these because I think they're very pretty and they were pretty cheap. <laughs> so see, sticker. Okay, and here we have a box of glitters. Look at that. Oh my. Yeah, I need a, a bigger craft room like uh, yesterday. So we got colorful glitters, different size and different shapes. This is like a little bit Query. And this is fine glitter. Oh, there's something sticky. Um, this is just a little bit like a bigger, bigger pieces. A fine glitter, small glitter, and then these uh, white and see-through stars and little tiny details. All right, then this big package. has uh, more package in it. I'm not really sure why they do this. I think maybe they see that they, it's coming to like the same address. They just put them in one box and ship it to the client, customer, who is me. So, but anyways, it was received. That's all that matters. First we have a thank you a package with uh, some gifts in it. We have some uh, stickers and some paper so this is a gift oh this is very cool and then they give a couple of uh, stuff as a gift i think that's that's adorable it's very nice of them usually people do not give gifts so that was that was very kind of them and then i have uh i call this the background oh they even have their name on it's on every single one yeah it's a company called panalisa craft so i call this a background cutting die and we have the sentiment uh, one says thank you the other one says mm, i'm not really sure we'll find out when i cut it out flowers like the christmas flower the red one i keep forgetting the name of it and a kind of similar one but we have a christmas bells very cute and then we have a snow globe with reindeer and christmas trees very beautiful and also this dolly and then there's a couple of things in here we have this big wand which is like the size of my hand this is also gonna be into the background Three more oh look how beautiful this is a bee and beehive that is very unique. A bunny! <laughs> Perfect. And then, ooh, Easter eggs. Excellent. Some leaf feather. Not leaves, feathers. And a rose line. Here we have some clock. And then lastly, we have this fairy. And this is big about i would say five inches fairy with the moon and then these can be removed very nice 
I'm gonna put the bunny Easter stuff aside so I might use it. Okay, next one. Okay, for this we received a gift bag. This is kind of like a mash um, bag. What I do like to do with this is put catnip in it. So uh, my cat can play with it and sniff the catnips. I'm gonna try to show them a little bit faster, not too fast, but just so the video is not too extremely long. So if you want to see something closer, feel free to pause at any time. Mm, interesting. This, I think, is a teacup. A bear inside a teacup. I think so. That's what it looks like to me. Um, we have a really cute, kind of like a manga box <laughs> with heart. And then a, a funky house. Some uh, branches with birds. Easter. Um, and then we have this moth with a skull on the inside. You see that? There's a skull on the inside. Interesting. And then a metallic fish. Industrial. Industrial fish, some hearts, more hearts. Very, very interesting. Mushroom house. Hearts with wings. Another mushroom house. Teacup with bunnies chilling inside of it. I think this is supposed to be another teacup with the bunny's head coming out of it. That'll be funny. And then a bunny in a hat. And then we have a bunny in, in sweaters. A bunny in a cup again. Well, we'll see. We'll make a card out of it and then uh, we'll see how it turns out. Alright, last package for this video. Okay, it looks like we got some good stuff in here. First up, we have stamps. I know you cannot really see it. These are very large. They are the dragonfly stamps. Moving Panda. Oh yeah, the company is called Moving Panda. So in here we have uh, this, which I feel like is a duplicate, or at least I have this one. But this is great, we can do a background color on it, the black one, and then an outline. And we also got some great sentiments. And then we have uh, strawberry, yes, this is strawberries very cute and for this and the next one this vitamix and kitchen tools appliances you can put faces on it how cute is that you see there's the little faces you can put them on it and there are a few more on the bottom and for these they also sent two extra folders for it which is very nice and the last one for today is this huge oh everything is falling there's so much stuff in front of me there's this huge huge almost a hand size stamp i really like it it looks like there's a lot of details in it but it's a uh, it's clean detail so it's not too crowded in one spot looks very good i'm excited to test this one although the sentiments are very small I don't like to do heat embossing with sentiments that are this tiny because it just melts together. I prefer to use something that's about this size or even better than this size, so about nail size. If you want to do heat embossing because the tiny tiny ones like this one on the bottom, like this one right here, it will just melt together. Or at least I have not had luck with it. So yeah, there was a lot of things today. Look at that. Um, I have plenty more packages that I need to do in the next video. So thank you so much for watching. I opened a playlist just for the hauls because I do have a lot more stuff that I want to show you guys. And I thought that would be easier for you to find it in one playlist where it's not mixed together with other videos so thank you so much for watching if you have any questions please let me know most of these 
items came from AliExpress and the sellers often change the products so it's hard for me to find the same seller but I will try to find similar things from Amazon and for those you can find them linked down below. Have a fantastic day.